Hey guys, welcome back to the Sexy Chef Kitchen. Tonight I'm making salmon puttanesca that's taste and figure friendly. And if you're Italian like me, you know that puttanesca is all about the sauce and this one will blow your mind. For the sauce, we start with one diced onion in olive oil and one green bell pepper. Next, you'll want to season this with some salt and pepper, and I always like to add some crushed red pepper to give it a little extra heat. Next, we're adding three cans of petite diced tomatoes. Next, you're going to add some chopped Kalamata olives, which is the key to any good puttanesca, some capers, and you'll want to rinse those first because they tend to be a little salty. And I love to add some marinated artichoke hearts. You'll gently mix all of this together and we're going to cover this and let this simmer for at least 35 minutes, but I would recommend simmer it on low for an hour. Mmm, I can almost taste it. You'll also want to add in two tablespoons of chopped garlic, some salt and pepper. Last but not least, we're adding in a bunch of chopped basil. In my opinion, there simply is nothing that compares to the taste and smell of fresh basil. It brightens any dish, and the smell is divine. Our lovely salmon will be by far the easiest part of the entire dish. Simply season with salt and pepper, place face down on a baking sheet, and bake at 350 for about 25 minutes until it flakes to perfection. At this point, we're way overdue for a wine break, but I also really wanted to tell you about this great product that I'm now endorsing. If you bruise easily like me, this revolutionary product will literally change your life. Last week, I went to MMA training camp because I'm a badass bitch. And I got pretty bruised. Then a friend told me about badass bitch cream, and I was like, mind blown. This shit works. So if you're a badass bitch like me, you better get some badass bitch cream. scrumptious. And one of my favorite things about making a dish that has to cook for a little bit is the fact that you can have a dance party. Appetite, we're going to top this perfectly cooked salmon with some of our delicious puttanesca sauce and then I always like to add a little bit more fresh basil and a little crushed red pepper. Now we'll dive in. Dive in! Unbelievable. You've got to try this. The flavors blend so well together, I know that you're going to love it. And you know what I love? The fact that you're here watching. It's been real. And remember, you can't rush perfection, darling. Enjoy. Until next time, I'm the Sexy Chef Liz. This is BBC One. We're interrupting our program for a BBC News report. The Sexy Chef Liz is making headlines again.
as she is now endorsing yet another product, and this time, it's literally a knockout. That story, up next. This new revolutionary badass bitch cream is turning heads and getting nods of approval from major celebrities and athletes alike. Caitlyn Jenner was reported as saying, quote, I used to be just a badass, but now I'm a badass bitch. You go, Kate. It seems that nothing can go wrong for this hot celebrity chef. She was even spotted drinking tea with Melania Trump, Kim Kardashian, and Jennifer Lopez. She gave them all a copy of her book. Rumor has it, she may even consider running in the next presidential election. I mean, I'm really good at different languages, and I look great in a business suit. Well, you've got my vote. Until next time, I'm the Sexy Chef Liz, reporting live for BBC News. Good night. <laughs>